Hey everyone, what's going on? I am Rob of The Howling Hour and I'm here on behalf of Scott and Exploring Attractions. Let me say thank you to Scott for letting me cover this event for him and also on behalf of Exploring Attractions and Scott, let me say thank you to Midsummer Scream for inviting us out to their Seasons Screaming event here in Pasadena, California. Um, I came through last night just real quick just to see what they had going on, you know, kind of get a lay of the land. And I'm real excited to bring you guys through here to check out the cool vendors. Check, they got some mazes in here, uh, some meet and greets. So we're going to do it all. Once again, thanks, Scott, and thank you, Midsummer. <laughs> So I am here in the Hall of Yuletide Spirit. They got some displays. They got a couple of little, uh, uh, little walk, little maze walkthroughs. We're gonna go through here. We're gonna check them out. Everything looks really cool so far. Love all the festive colors with the very overwhelming hint of spooky. It has cranberry sauce. Cranberry sauce. Happiness. Okay. Peppermint. Uh huh. And a little bit of uh, Santa special sauce. Santa special sauce. From his well, special cabinet. Well, Santa, you seem very busy. I don't want to bother you. I know you got a lot of gifts to pass out and a lot of drinks to drink. I, I gotta check that list too. You gotta check the list. So Santa's gonna check the list. We wanna say thank you to Santa for coming down from the North Pole. Uh, there he goes, as sober as ever.
All right, all right, everybody gets one. What? It's a, it's a roach. No, this is my cousin Martha. Oh, sorry. How roach? Sorry, my apologies. Hello, people of the world. I am Psychic Buster, as it says on my case here. It's yeah, a, we're recording. Um, this, this is an impossible object. A friend of mine actually took a Rubik's Cube apart, put it in the bottle, and then reassembled it. You can't take it back apart and take it out. It gets stuck. So the only way to solve the Rubik's Cube now is to break the bottle. So you have to destroy the piece of art to solve the Rubik's Cube. An impossible object. No way to solve it without destroying it. This is also an impossible object. Because I have just as much chance of solving this one as I do of solving that one. <laughs> Are you good at solving Rubik's Cubes? No. Good! Me neither. <laughs> Mix that up for me. Oh, okay. And you don't okay. have to solve it. I actually want you to make it worse. Make it as mixed as you possibly can. <laughs> okay. Okay. It works. Okay. You could not count to a quintillion in your lifetime. Okay. 43 quintillion possible outcomes of a cube. The idea that I could know the combination that you came up with on that cube and then solve it, completely impossible. Yeah, don't, don't applaud that. <laughs> no, no, see, here. That's the one you mixed up. <laughs> but, but, no, hang on, hang on. Here's the cool thing, though. So, if I had solved it, that would have been a neat trick. Yeah. But, like I said, 43 quintillion possible combinations. The chances of that cube matching any other cube on the entire planet anywhere are astronomical. Sure. But I brought this one. And those match. Not only that, that side matches too. Three, four, bottom and top. All what? six sides match against impossible odds. Nice to thank you. <laughs> I did it psychically. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck off! No, keep it moving! Keep it moving! So that's pretty much gonna wrap it up here at Midsummer Screams, Season Screamings. Uh, let me say once again, thank you so much on behalf of Scott and Exploring Attractions. Thank you to uh, Midsummer Scream for inviting us out and allowing us to cover this event. Really appreciate it. Also, let me thank Scott for letting me cover this event for him. Always grateful. Um, we had some really good vendors in there. The Hall of Yuletide Spirits was awesome. Uh, you know, this, the, the way they dressed it up with the mazes and just the, the, the decorations, it looked really good. Um, the characters, as always, uh, they looked amazing. They brought it. Everyone in there just did 
phenomenal job. If you like this video, hit that like button. Uh, we, we really do appreciate it. If you had not subscribed to Exploring Attractions, hit that subscribe button so you know anytime a video like this is posted. Uh, you know, Scott does all kinds of videos from, from haunted events to, to Christmas events, theme parks, he does it all. Uh, so you wanna definitely be subscribed to his channel so you are in the know for anything event, haunt, theme park related. I am Rob of The Howling Hour. Once again, thank you, Scott, for letting me cover this event for you. Positivity is key, and remember to always keep exploring.